Yep. It's time. It's time I finally do this. Hello, buddy. My name's Jackson, and welcome back to another video where today I am playing Getting Over It with Bennett Foddy. Now, I played a little bit of this. Um, it, it was on the school computers at school. Uh, like the, the collaboration drive where you know, that's about it. I played a little bit at school. Um, that's about it. Um, never actually gotten into the game enough to consider myself as having played it. But here we are. I am committed to go through it. Oh. Ah, yes. I'm committed to do this. Now, I only have a little little baby mouth pad. I don't know if you can see. Um, but it should be fine. Oh, I hate this. Alright, so... I've never really understood... The story! Oh, God, okay. Don't get angry yet. Never understood the story of this game. But... I'm sure it's fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm. I'm fine. Excuse me. There we go. Uh, <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh, I need a bigger mouse pad. Oh my god, I need a bigger mouse pad for this. And up and over. And up and over. There's no feeling more intense oh, than starting over. Mm. You deleted your homework the day before it was due, as I have. Or if you left your wallet at home and you have to go back after spending an hour in the commute. If you want some money at the casino and then put all your winnings on red but it came up black. If you got your best shirt dry cleaned before a wedding and then immediately dropped food on it. If you want an argument with a friend and then later discovered that they just returned to their original view. Starting over is harder than starting up. If you're not ready for that, like if you've already had a bad day, then what you're about to go through might be too much. Feel free to go away and come back. I'll be here. Thanks for coming with me on this trip. I'll understand if you have to take a break at any point. Just find a safe place to stop and quit the game. Don't worry. I'll save your progress, always. Even your mistakes. Oh, even my mistakes? Oh, you little weenie. This game is a homage to a free game that came out in 2002, titled Sexy Hiking. The author of that game was Jazuo, a mysterious Czech designer who was known at the time as the father of B games. And B games are rough assemblages of found objects. Designers slap them together very quickly and freely, and they're often too rough and unfriendly to gain much of a following. <laughs> They're built more for the joy of building them than as polished products. In a certain way, Sexy Hiking is the perfect embodiment of a bee game. It's built almost entirely out of found and recycled parts. And it's one of the most unusual and unfriendly games I've In it, your task is simply to drag yourself up a mountain with a hand. Sounds very familiar! And that act of climbing, in the digital world or in real life, has certain essential properties that give the game its flavor. No amount of forward progress. Can I pause? Guarantee. Okay, I can. All right, mouse sensitivity. Turn up. Okay, I'll turn you down a bit. Just. Okay. How's my laptop? Going? Okay. And the player is constantly, unremittingly in danger of falling into the game. Okay, no, I turned that down too much. Anyway, when you start sexy hiking, you're standing next to this dead tree that blocks the way to the entire rest yeah. of the game. It might take you an hour to get over that tree, and a lot of people never got past it. You prod and you poke at it, exploring the limits of your reach and your strength, trying to find a way up and over. And there's a sense of truth in that lack of compromise. Most obstacles in video game worlds are fake. You can be completely confident in your ability to get through them, once you have the correct method, or the correct oh, equipment, yeah, or just yes. by spending enough time. In that sense, every pixelated obstacle in Sexy Hiking is real. Okay, I'm doing something! This is the furthest I've gotten, actually. <laughs> Ever. No! What am I supposed to do? Okay. What if I just... Eh. 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 No! 
You don't do that to me, you little little rascal. Uh, 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 the opposite uh, of uh, hiking are unyielding, and that makes the game uniquely frustrating. But I'm not sure Jazuo intended to make a frustrating game. The frustration is just essential to the act of climbing, and it's authentic to the process of building a game about climbing. A funny thing happened to me as I was building this mountain. Yeah. I'd have an idea for a new obstacle, and I'd build it, test it, and it would usually turn out to be unreasonably hard. But I couldn't bring myself to make it easier. It already felt like my inability to get past the new obstacle was my fault as a player rather than as a builder. Imaginary mountains build themselves from our efforts to climb them. And it's our repeated attempts to reach the summit that turns those mountains into something real. Ugh. Ugh, don't, don't push off it! No! <laughs> what is happening? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I need a stress toy. I can already tell I'm going to have a f very fun time with this game. Not. Alright. So just... Uh. 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 Okay, what if I just uh, uh, uh. <laughs> What's happening? There you go. Alright. Are you kidding? You're not going off that! That's not a choice here! You're not allowed to! Like, how am I supposed to get up there? What is... How, how is that... Actually... Plausible? Like, you can't grip onto it. Let's just... Steady us out- Steady- STEADY OUR GROUND HERE! Let's just steady our ground. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Uh. Alright, let's just steady our bloody ground. Uh. Uh. Am I supposed to like push off of this? Here? Like this? Like. Alright, look at the muscles of this man though, like, god damn! Alright, anyway. Okay. Alright. Steady. STEADY! STEADY! STEADY. Ugh. I WAS DOING IT! No! Oh my god, okay. No! Oh, you just lost a lot of progress. That's a deep frustration. A real punch in the gut. Okay. It's fine. I didn't lose that much. He's just over-exaggerating. It's fine. I wasn't that into it. I wasn't that far into it. It's fine. It's... It's okay. Everything's fine. Everything's okay. Everything's... Everything's hunky-dory. Everything's absolutely supercalifragilisticexpialidocious. It may seem quite a Oh my god, are you serious? It may seem quite atrocious at first. Then you realize that this game sucks. Poo! Alright. Alright, let's just. It's all about momentum. All. Oof, sorry. Shut up! I already hate this guy. Oh my god. Okay, let's just take a deep breath. Let's just... It's fine. Get up on the stupid mountain. Get up on the stupid mountain! Get up! 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 Did I mention you have to go up? Maybe up is the thing to do? Up. 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 Ah, up, 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 
up, up, up, up, up, up, uppy, uppy, ooh, uppy, ooh. All right, we're back to where we were pretty much. See, didn't lose that much progress. See, here we are. Okay, get back on this. Get back on this. Ugh. Oh, look at that! Don't do that. I don't appreciate that. No! No! Alright. It's okay. We did make it further for a second. Alright, this is a bit of a problem. I don't want to go over this. I just want to... <laughs> Alright. How- what? When you're building a video game world, you're building with ideas. What? And that can be like working with quickset cement. You mold your ideas into a certain shape that can be played with, and in the process of playing with them, they begin to harden and set until they're immutable, like rock. And at that point, you can't change the world. Not without breaking it into pieces and starting fresh with new ideas. Why is this man in the cauldron? Oh! I bet that's one question Ben up Foddy never answered. Why the hell is this man in a cauldron? Why am I going backwards? Why did that just... Okay. Oh my god, I'm so... Angry already. Oh! Ah! You're gonna hear a lot of sounds from me, I am sorry, but this is the kind of game that you don't really speak to because you're screaming at it! Okay, we're good. We're good. Okay. So you have to, like, really quickly. I just. Send to the ground. Well, that, that worked. Alright, I'm on a rock now. I need to get on that light. I know I do. But how? Ugh. Like that? Well, obviously not. not on the... You've done this part before. You know it's possible. Oh, shut up. I haven't done this part before. You lie. All right, this way. Do, 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 Am I supposed to get on top of this black rock? Is that my goal here? Is that is that is that is that the goal? <laughs> For years yes! now, people have been predicting that games would soon be made out of prefabricated objects, <laughs> bought in a store and assembled into a world. And for the most part, that hasn't happened. Because the objects in the stores are trash. I don't mean they look bad or that they're badly made, although a lot of them are. I mean they're trash in the way that food becomes trash as soon as you put it in the sink. Things are made to be consumed and used in a certain context. And once the moment is gone, they transform into garbage. In the context of technology, those moments pass by in seconds. Okay. okay. Oh. 
You have to like really quickly do that. Otherwise, it's just too slow, and then you start moving away. You have to start, like. Long stretches, long stretches, long. Okay, I'll, that should be a short one. Okay. It's good to build up your arm muscle because you're just rotating your hand. Like, literally, that is all I'm doing. Oh, God. No, get away. Get away. Alright, what if I. Try this differently, all right? Nice and slow. Fine, screw, screw slow, screw slow. Slow sucks, slow is for wimps. And that's why I'm gonna do it. All right. Nice and slow, all right. Yeah. I need like enough speed to get to that big thing. <sighs> this thing. <Yep. sighs> oh. <gasps> oh! Okay. I'm making some progress. Hum, ha, who, ah, oh. oh, that would have been it. So far. more and more refuse into this vast digital landfill that we call the internet. It now vastly outnumbers and outweighs the things that are fresh and untainted and unused. Thank you for your support. When everything around us is cultural trash, trash becomes the new medium, the lingua franca of the digital age. Thank you. And you can build culture out of trash, but only trash culture. B games, B movies, B music, B philosophy. Thank you for your so philosophical point of view. I do not want to hear it though. I don't care. The vertical wall here has a way of getting it harder the more times you try it. I think anger makes you swing the hammer harder and that can push you away from the wall. Okay. 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 Alright. Okay. Alright. Okay. Right. I'm so lightheaded from breathing and hyperventilating. Yeah. No, 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 right, no, no, Keep on trying. no, I'm done, I'm done already, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my, oh, oh my god. Ended it there. She just ended the damn video there. She just ended it there. She just 
made progress and ended the video, but no, I had to keep going, didn't I? I had to keep going, I had to keep pushing it. You don't know me, you piece of crap. Loser in a cauldron looking piece of crap. Whatever, you know what? Screw it. No. You know what? Screw it. I'm I'm only at the start but this thing that we call failure is not the falling down, but the staying down. But I'm down. staying down until Mary next Pickford. episode. I don't care about Mary Pickford. I'm sh okay, I I don't know who she is, but I I'm done for today. I'll do another video another time. But if you liked it, give it a thumbs up. I I'll do another one. Just so subscribe. Thank you to my editor cat for Editing? Can only imagine what you've been going through. Considering you've been listening to me screaming for the past 20-ish minutes. And I'll see you all in the next video. See ya! Bye! I'm out! I'm done! I'm gone! Bye!